Um, the second part of the strength is the unilateral stiff-legged deadlift and kettlebell. The main thing with the, um, with the deadlift is that you have to make sure that you're really squeezing those glutes, really um, anchoring your feet into the ground, driving through the heels, maintaining open collarbones, lengthening your neck, and driving your abs in and out to protect your lower back. Um, this is a big one for most of us. And also when you go down, you go about mid, mid, mid shin, and then you really squeeze your glutes and drive through the glutes on the way up. So this is how it looks. Again, we're approaching the same way, getting to the position. From here, with your arms by your side, so without, this is about slightly shoulder, shoulder under the shoulder, shoulder width. <laughs> You shift your weight to the left leg if you start with the leg or in reverse. Then make sure that your hips align and you're not opening your hips when you go down. So your hips, shoulders are working on the box. You squeeze your leg and you go down and through the heel and glute drive up. Again we go down. Long neck, abs in and up and drive up. And then pull the both legs and then switch. The second part is kettlebell press. I'm using a 25 pound kettlebell. With the kettlebell, place it slightly in front of you. So, so your body and your hand kind of forms a V shape. Place your hand in the center of the kettlebell. Put the weight on your heels, swing a little bit back, swing the leg up a bit, and clean it up. So now over here, once it's nice and wrapped, Again, glutes are tight, driving through the heels, open collarbones, nice long neck, abs in and up, press, 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 re rack. So this is the second exercise. The third one, part of the workout is Walking lunges with overhead weight. You can either use a plate, dumbbells, I'm using a sandbag, and uh, reverse pull-ups. So from the sandbag, clean it up, place it on your knuckles. Press the weight overhead. Oops, sorry, my ceiling is too hot, too low. You'll step forward and lunge. And then just keep walking. What you'll do is you'll do two sets of 15. And the second part is of the superset is reverse pull-ups. Um, you can do reverse pull-ups on um, by placing a bar on the rack. You can do it with TRX or cross core. I got both. Um, I think it's a great exercise. It'll help you strengthen your upper body immensely and also it'll help on strengthen your lower body because you really have to keep it tight, you really hug the midline, use your inner thighs, glutes, abs, everything to keep straight and protect your lower back and really get the power because the whole power doesn't just come from the arms, it's the upper back, not the whole back, it's the core and if you just notice the difference if you tighten the abs, tighten the midline, it, this is where your power is coming from so let's get to it. You can either start in the tabletop position. I'm too close, guys, sorry. You can start in tabletop position or legs out. So arms under the prime line and straight, going up and down, up and down, or tabletop. Really squeeze those glutes, abs tight, drive through the shoulders. And the last part is the... So for the plank, for the walking plank, for the first part of our metabolic trigger response burn, is the walking plank. Well, I already said that. Get into the push-up position. And the main thing is to move your, uh, to move your feet and arms at the same time. Left, right, press, up, press, up, press, up, press, up. So for this one, sorry, I forgot to say, what you'll do, you'll set up your gym boss timer for 
20 intervals. And then you're gonna go back to back to back to back. 30 seconds walking, press, plank to jump lunges. You really drive through the heel, stay upright, touch the opposite leg, knee down, drive through the heels, come up, squeeze the glute. Really working the legs. Well, anyway, this is the end of our first workout of the month. And stay tuned. Check out my website, www.sfe.com or free to be fit.com.us. I don't even know my own website. Well, anyway, I would like to hear back from you. Any feedback, comments, and I hope to see you soon, guys. Thanks. Bye. Hi, guys. I hope you enjoyed the workout. I'm done. The main thing is just don't give up on yourself. Sometimes we have to do a modification, and it doesn't mean that you will never get to a full expression. This is just where you are right now, and um, for example, me with reverse pull-ups, I did six straight leg, and the rest I did in the tabletop. The main thing is just keep on going. You will build your strength as you progress. So, hope to see you soon in the day. And in, in the meanwhile, just eat clean and stay positive. Have a good weekend.